hey guys thank you so much for tuning into the channel so this week i thought i would take you guys along with me as i plan for the week i am using the printable that i talked about in my planning video if you're not sure what i'm talking about i will leave the link explaining how to use this document down below and i also have a free printable for you guys so if you want to use a version of this for yourself you'll be able to find the link down in the description box below so right here i'm just outlining the routines that i want to focus on for the week so you guys saw where i mapped out my daily routines and also assigned when i would like to get them accomplished throughout the day and here i'm just uh, marking when i would like to accomplish my weekly routines once again if you guys want a more thorough explanation feel free to refer back to the previous video where i discussed this here i'm just picking out some zone cleaning goals i'll be working in my master bedroom this week so i found about four or five things that I would like to see improved in that room and I'm documenting it there just to keep track of it. This is an undated printable. So here I'm just marking the days of the week and um, now I'm working on my basic weekly plan. And so for the basic, basic weekly plan, I have themed days. So I'm just going through my to-do list and I'm making sure to sort out my to-do list according to the theme. And um, so once again, if you want to see how I theme my days or get ideas about that, please refer to the other video. And here I'm just mapping out what I would like to see get done over the weekend. Usually I do self-care day on Saturday and family fun day on Sunday, but because it's my baby's, my twin baby's birthday this weekend, I decided to swap those. Um, here I'm just marking the time when I usually do my zone cleaning and I was thinking of a couple of things that I would like to grab from the store, so I just used that little spot to write down some notes for myself. So here, um, I'm just marking. My kids are taking some classes online for fun, so I just wanted to notate here so that I wouldn't forget about it throughout the week. And it looks like here, I just wanted to mark that I have a goal of doing yoga throughout the week and the morning before the kids get up. And there are some parts of my days that are just kind of blocked off. Like I just, that's our natural flow. So this is one of those things for us. We usually do snack time around three o'clock. Usually I do bath time around five o'clock-ish. Usually I do dinner between six to seven. So since I just do those things naturally, I'm just blocking off that time because I usually am not able to do other things because of the nature of those hours. And here I'm just notating that the babies take a nap during this time. So if there's anything that I want to do that I can't do with them, this is a good time to do it. And so I was just playing around with how I wanted to label that. And I just wanted to make sure to leave space there just in case I had like a, something that came up that I needed to jot down. Like here where I plan to make a birthday cake during nap time on Saturday. Okay, what's next? Um, all right, so here I'm just trying to add a little color and so I've seen people use the highlighter just to spice things up. So that's what I'm doing right here. And I am learning how to make stickers. So that's me just adding a sticker for a pop of color. And so you'll see in just a moment, I actually get rid of that sticker. I decide that I don't like it. Um, here's another sticker that I decided to use to keep track of my little mini shopping list. And, uh, also, I went to Google, I did a Google search for a little birthday cake, and I just copied and pasted it onto the document to signify the birthday this weekend. So that's it. I went ahead and printed it. As much as I love digital planning, I have to have my to-do list and my schedule right in front of me. And I don't like having to click through my tablet to find it. So I like to print it. And the digital planning part helps me keep everything nice and neat and clean, which I like as well. So that's it. Thank you so much for watching this video. Remember, if you want a copy of this printable, I will have the link to it down in the description below. And if you also want more details about the system that I use to keep up with homekeeping and the home management, then I will have the links to those videos down below as well. I will see you guys in the next video. Please make sure you like on the way out. It really helps my channel. Bye guys, see you next week.